tonight. Tristan tries an aerial attack. Mike blames Pete. I'm sorry. I blame Pete. And Pete goes for a walk. Why are there no cars anywhere? Hello everyone and welcome to Lawrence Plays for some more Manhunt Checkpoint. And after the success last week and the, and the week before of the um, the copying what the of copying the praise car to the hunters, so they're always forced to drive the same car as I am, we thought we'd um, tweak that uh, game mode a little further. And we've now got a system where um, uh, ooh, that was that was Mark. Um, we now have a system. Where, when, whenever the prey picks a car, the hunters are put into a random car of the same class. So because I'm driving this uh, dilettante, which is a compact, all the hunters are also put into dilettantes as well. Um, oh, sorry, no, they're all put, also put into compacts, but they're all put into random compacts. So they, they know that I'm in a compact, but not what, which, not which particular, which particular model of compact. So that should, well, that was unfortunate, and now I'm stuck. Um. So yes, they know that I'm driving a compact, but they don't know which particular one. So it makes it 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 keeps the the whole point of doing that was to keep the game a little bit more even and everyone have everyone in um, more similar cars and to encourage me to use a bit more variety rather than always using basically the best car that was available to me. Um, but without giving quite the same level of giveaway of, as to what I'm driving, because if I'm driving a um, ooh, that's that's Mark again. Is he going away? Yes, he is. Let's change cars because this one's damaged and will stick out like a sore thumb. So here we go. I'll switch into this one. And if you watch his car over there, it's just, it disappears out. Oh, it's just gone out of sight now. So we probably won't get to see it. But I'm now in a Gresley anyway. So now all the hunters will also be in 4x4s. And the fact that I've just changed vehicle will hopefully be enough to, sort of, to throw them off a little bit and confuse them and, and give me a... Well, I don't know whether it'll actually help at all. But um, it'll, at least, it'll at least keep things interesting for them. Which, and that's what this is all about, isn't it? So, I'm now, as you can see, on the approach to Chinese, the Chinese Monument checkpoint. They don't know what checkpoint I'm going for, because we still have the, um, the checkpoints hidden for the hunters. Because before we did this, it was a bit too easy for them. They could basically set up an ambush at whatever checkpoint I was going to. Whereas now, they don't know where I'm going. So it's up to them to sort of to guess a little bit. What's that? Is that an F620? No, it's not. It's an exemplar. Let's take that. This isn't going to help my chances of getting away because um, it's going to be a much faster car and therefore they're going to have faster cars. Oh no, it's a Mascaro. Uh, Masa whatever. Um, which is a sports car. So now they're all going to be in sports cars, which is going to make this all a little bit um, higher risk, shall we say. Because every if everybody's in a much better car, then it makes everything a bit faster. And so I think I've probably got a better chance of escaping. But I've also got a much higher chance of having an accident because I'm in a much faster car. And that was Mark going past yet again. He seems to be around quite a lot at the moment, Ooh, and, and Pete as well. And they're all going nice and quickly because they're in uh, they're in sports cars as well. Because because well, it's my it's entirely my fault. That's why they've got them. So the slightly funny thing about this game mode is that because the um, the game chooses a random car from that class, they could end up with something that's completely. Um, uh, they, they could end up with any absolutely any sports car when I get into into a sports, um, and that includes all the various ones that aren't aren't actually spawning as natural or just don't spawn as natural spawns at all. So there's quite a lot of potential for something weird to, for them to end up in really weird cars. And I basically have to avoid supercars. I mean, I do avoid supercars anyway because they kind of change how the game works a bit too much. Um, but if I get into a supercar, then they could end up in actual genuine racing cars, which is a bit excessive and will probably be better than anything I can find and pick up. So I'm going to stick to probably nothing better than a sports, which is my normal way of playing anyway. So there are two checkpoints now I can go for. I have a choice between North Vinewood and Casino Bridge. Now I'm very close to North Vinewood, especially because of the way I've just hooned over here like a lunatic. So I'm going to now change cars into, what should we have? Let's let's have this, um, this Prius. This, no, not that one. Stop it. Get into this one. Get into this dilettante here, and this—the th the theory of this, to an extent, is that because I drove over here at high speed and then changed into a much worse car, hopefully they're going to be only about halfway over and they're going to struggle to get over here as quickly as they would like to. So we'll see. Whether, I don't know whether that's actually going to be the case or not. I'm going to go fairly slowly because I don't want to—I don't want—I don't want to be too, a bit 
too unfair about this. So um, whilst I've, I think I've probably thrown them off a little bit by doing that, I'm now going to drive a little bit more sensibly. So we need to keep, as always, the hunters are in their ludicrously coloured vehicles. So we need to keep an eye out for any any brightly coloured cars with, um, again, brightly coloured underglow and headlights and so on. They will really they should stick out like a sore thumb. That's the whole point of colouring them like that. Um, and oh dear, I've got a big queue building up behind me. Have time to go. Uh, let's put a little bit of power down as much as this Prius can just to try and get away from that massive queue behind me in the hope that if I'm a little bit further away from it the hunters won't get quite so suspicious. Right, here is checkpoint number two. So I'm just going to pull up at it. I'm going to boop it now even though I'm sat at the uh, lights next to it. And we'll see how this goes. Now this is a sort of a... The hunters will expect me to be fleeing from the scene of the uh, checkpoint at this point. So there's a green light so we'll go anyway. And if sometimes if you hang around for sort of a few seconds longer, then it makes them. Then it means you can. Um, it, mean, it means they're going to be looking for cars that have already left. When you and if you haven't already left, then that can be a bit of a sort of an advantage and a, a little bit of extra safety for you. So I'm going to go this way because there was a green light. And okay, here's two of the hunters. They're both in those weird. I'm not sure what. I'm not even quite sure what they are. But I think, unfortunately, from earlier playtesting. I have a feeling they're quite a bit faster than I am. So this might be um, a tricky escape to, to pull off. Ooh, that's... Yeah, they're definitely better cars than mine. Uh, um, I don't know what that is. That appears to be some sort of small police car that... Um, I think... Is that Pete or Mark? I'm not sure. One of them was... Oh, no, there's, there's probably Mark in a probably Mini. Um, so, oh, this is going to be difficult because, as I say, their cars, I believe, are better than mine. So let's... But let's put some speed down here and go oop, down the hill and try and get a little bit... See if I can get a little bit away from them with a bit of speed. Now, Mike always mocks me for doing the, sort of the straight line run thing. Um, but there is, a reason I, there is a reason I do it, which I haven't explained in too much detail to him in case he actually starts to understand. But the point is that if you... Um, if you go in a straight line for a short for a little while, then it throws the hunters off to an... Or no, it doesn't throw the hunters off because they know exactly where you're going. And that's why he mocks it. But it does mean I know I now know they're all basically strung out in a line behind me. There aren't any of them ahead of me. So if I start weaving in and out of corners, they won't know... Um, I, I, won't, I shouldn't run into one of them. Um, unfortunately, I'm on the, um, on the highway, which isn't great when their cars are faster than mine. So I'm going to have to come up here and try and get round a corner like that. Oh, there's purple trying to get really a bit too, up, a bit too close and personal with me. But the theory is, yes, as I say, now now because I've got that a bit of distance over them, hopefully I can then do something not not distance over them, but distance away from where we started so they aren't they aren't going to be clustered around that area. Now maybe there's a chance of me finding roads to duck into Ooh, or alternatively you just get spun around like that that's not helpful because there's Mike as well let's try and go this way instead and spin him around as well see how he likes it <laughs> right okay that hasn't gone as well as I hoped probably because I end Ooh, oh. Ooh, that was an interesting um, pile driver maneuver there so the theory what the um, the hope was that I'd be able to get away a little bit by doing that unfortunately it didn't really work yeah Come on, there we go. It didn't work as well as I would have liked because I, I sort of misjudged the freeway a bit and ended up on the freeway when I didn't really want to be there. Um, and end up, you end up going further on the freeway than I wanted to, or rather, that's probably a better way of describing it. Um, did it? Yes, he made that corner. I'm not surprised. It wasn't a particularly difficult dodge I did that. Whoa, that was. Well, it was a nice 360 at least, but that's not going to help me get away. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, so I ended up on the on the highway for a bit longer than I really wanted to, and that gave me some problems um, because it meant I was yeah the going in a, the going I was going in a straight line for for far too long with cars that are better than mine following me, and that was very much a problem. Ooh. Can I get into the into the canals here? I kind of can. Uh, now I've only got one of them following me. At least as far as I can see. Oh no, I think there's another one at the other end of the canals as well. So there's a couple of them sort of vaguely behind me. But I'm, I was going to say not too close. Not too close. There's only one of them close behind me. So there's only one of them I really need to throw off. But I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do that. Because as I said, he's got a faster car than me. So I just need to try and... Oh! 
I was going to say, I need to get lucky and not have any accidents, and immediately had an accident, and now there's two of them right there. So, this is not going too well, but hopefully if I just keep going like... Oh, I could turn my lights off, that's always a good plan. Um, I mean, it's not, I'm not sure it's dark enough for that to help, but it's very worth doing because it helps to hide me a bit. I'm Now I'm doing the straight line thing again. Let's try this corner. Did he overshoot? No, he didn't. Damn it. I was hoping with my late braking there that it was going to give him some issues. Oh, he's had some. He's had a few minor issues. Nothing serious enough, unfortunately. Ooh, is this a way in? Oh no, I misjudged that completely. And that. Oh. So my plan. I had a cunning plan. It was to go into the alleyway there. It didn't. I didn't manage to pull it off because I didn't manage to turn into it quickly enough. And then I just got battered around all over the place, which is very unhelpful. So. I'm going to try and get, I don't know, try something else. Now, one they are all together now, and that potentially is a good thing. Because having all of them together means there's a chance that they'll have some issues with it driving into each other. Um, now, I can't be sure, and it's hard to, and you can't really rely on that very well. But you can hope that they're going to come a cropper by driving into each other. Um, this might be a... That was a bad corner. Here's a checkpoint. I mean, I could... No, I can't... I, I could take it. I'm not going to take it because we're currently um, full chase mode. Oop, that was Mike. That's unfortunate. That's an SUV. That's even more unfortunate because I drove into it. Ah, oh, I can't get going. Can't get going. Can't get going. There we go. Can get going. He's shooting at me. Now, fortunately... Be Aha! Right, that's good. So, <laughs> um... Which way around was that? Um... Pete ran over Mike on the way through there, so that's taken both Mike and Pete out of the chase. Um, I'm not sure where they're going to be spawning in again, um, because oh, I think there's a hospital fairly nearby here, actually, so they'll probably be spawning in there. Um, oh, crunch. That's So then they're going to be back with me before too long. Um... Get lost. Stop it. <laughs> right. Tristan was pointing the wrong way, which gives me a little bit of a head start there. Not really enough to, for me to actually get away with it, but enough to sort of help a little... Oh, I could have gone in there. That might have been a good idea. Actually, he's, he is close enough behind me, though, that I suspect almost no matter what I do... He's still going to see where I go. I'm not going to be able to pull off a dive into an alleyway without him seeing it. And the problem with pulling off a dive into an alleyway anyway is that you're quite visible as you do it. Ooh, but I think he might... Ooh, there's Mike. <laughs> oh no, don't hit the wall. And don't then hit the reverse. Just the wrong moment. Ooh, is that... Have I done it? I think... For goodness sake. Stop driving into things, Lawrence. <laughs> I think that sudden stop coming out of the... Um... Oh, no, this is a dead end as well. Okay, I'm going to park here. I'm going to get out of the car. And I'm going to... Run and just sort of... Join this group of civilians down here. Like this. I mean, I'm not quite dressed the same as them. But it's close enough. And now I can have a bit of a look around... I think, yes, I think I've got away. So, I did turn the circle off during that run, very much deliberately, um, with the intent of going, of uh, making sure that I, um, they, they couldn't use that to follow me if I did get away. So now it's time to go and try and find another car. There's quite a lot, there's a lot of cars driving around here, but I'm not sure. I don't know, this is quite a busy road, and I don't like stealing cars on busy roads because it feels dangerous. I feel like, um... I'm going to get spotted doing it and, and then attacked. So let's run up here a little bit. I heard screeching of tyres. Maybe it's okay. I think it might just be uh, AI sports cars. Now, have these lights gone red yet? Yes, they have. I could get that blister, but then they'll stay in their compacts. And I want them to... I want to shuffle their cars around a bit because I didn't like what they were chasing me in. Okay, let's go for another SUV. The SUVs aren't great, but 
at least they'll be in them as well. Right, there we go. Okay. So, circle circle back on. Big wobble from the car there. Let's try and drive a little better than that. Um, there's a Pete over there. He's gone past. Good. So now things have returned to normal. After all that chasing, I can go back to driving sensibly. And that means running red lights uh, when I think it's safe to. Because otherwise cars build up around you. And to be honest, it means you never get anywhere if you stop at all the red lights. And I've learnt from a few of these runs that you seem to be a lot more... Um, the runs seem to go a lot better when I play a bit more aggressively. So that means essentially running running red lights after having a quick check to make sure it's safe to do so. Um, and generally just not trying not to obey all of the traffic laws. Because obeying the traffic laws, it slows you down a lot, which means it takes you forever to get anywhere. Um, and that's a bad thing. However, if a hunter like that one that's just shot past over there sees me breaking the traffic laws, then they'll get very, very suspicious. He's gone off the other way though, so let's go. And the hunters aren't aren't subtle. If they get suspicious of me, they will attack the car. And they'll come over and ram it just to see if it is me. So there's not much point in trying to be. Um, yeah, th I don't need to worry too much about whether they've whether they're trying whether they're trying to trap trick me. Most of the time, they don't really do that. They'll just come and investigate hard. So if I if I think I've, especially if I think I've been driving reasonably sensibly, if they haven't rammed me at least once, I'm probably safe. So my plan is to come along here and then go up the alleyway up the middle of the um, through the tennis courts and try and get to golf course that way. It's not the best way to approach it, to be honest, um, because there because it's alleyways. Actually, let's so let's not let's into, or should we? No, I can go into this alleyway here. I think this will probably be sufficiently subtle. There we go. There is a car park here as well, which suggests you're sort of supposed to have cars around here. Um, but, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> it looks like a road. I mean, it basically is a road. It's just that it's a road that no cars ever use. So, this is going to be a little bit... Ooh, especially if I drive across the uh, pavement like that as I come out. That's going to be very suspicious. Okay, that's the checkpoint taken. Let's start driving a little more quickly. Okay, that went quite well. Now, that checkpoint used to be a really, really difficult one to take. Um, here comes a purple. There goes a purple. <laughs> um, it used to be a really, really difficult one to take, and orange as well. Are you going to... Nope, he stopped to investigate. Okay, we are now in another chase. So what they were trying to do there is one of them was parking in front of me and the other was trying to go around to park behind me so that they could get out and shoot the player in the face without him being able to uh, move the car away. Um, so it was there, basically it was essential for me to start moving then because they knew they knew I was there, they knew it was me. Or at least they had strong suspicions it was me but once they started investigating it would be far too late and I wouldn't be able to do anything about it. Um, and so they'd, they'd investigate and then I'd be in real real trouble. So whilst they hadn't actually really clocked it was me at that point, I had to get going. I couldn't I couldn't have left it because if as soon as they started trying to investigate, I'd have been in real trouble. So now we have another chase across the city. Um, we've got the wallowy SUVs this time. We don't have a great turn of speed. I think Tristan might actually be in exactly the same vehicle as me, which is I don't know. I mean, it's it, it's balanced and even at least, but it's a little bit unimaginative of the uh, of the of the game. So, um, which way shall I go? Let's go north here. Whoa, smack! Let's hope he has a similar problem. No, he didn't. He went around a little bit around a little bit wider and got and managed it better better than I did. That's a shame. Okay, so if I go whoop, around here, the problem is that these vehicles. Are, I have this habit of always braking before I come to a corner, um, because that's sort of what you you kind of need to do it especially in real life, in order to actually, you know, get round the corner. Um, the problem is, in uh, if you're driving a slow lumbering vehicle like one of these Gresley SUVs, then it just doesn't get round the corner. Let's drop off here as slowly as I can. Did he overshoot? He did. Excellent. That was exactly what I needed. 
Now, hopefully I can... Ooh. That wasn't quite what I meant to do. But you know what? I'll take it. It's It's got me moving in an unexpected direction. And that's what escaping is all about. So let's turn the headlights off again. Because that's always a good shout. And then let's try and find a way out of the storm drain. <laughs> that doesn't end in my demise. Uh, let's turn the circle off as well. That's a good idea. Because I don't want them to know where I am until I've... I don't want I don't want them to have the, the circle as a, as a guide to, to help them find me. Why does this go? Oh no, this goes into the tunnels. This is a bad idea. This is going to take me forever to... I mean, it's going to... It's going to take a long time to find my way back out again. But on the flip side, it's going to be very difficult for them to work out where I've gone. Um, it's just... An annoying and somewhat unimaginative. Well, I don't know. Imagine unimaginative isn't quite right because it is. I don't know what I'm trying to say, but it's it's not the way I'd like to have escaped because the tunnels are irritating. Um, hopefully, I also I don't know them very well because I try not to use them. Is that? Can you actually climb out of any of these ladders to get out? I don't think you can. I think I've tried this before, and the ladders all just go up to um, to platforms, elevated platforms, and then just don't. And, and but but with no actual way out of the. Uh, of the tunnel system. So I do just need to drive and drive and drive until I find a, a vehicular way out. Like, oh, this, this looks promising. Oh, no. No, it's just a skylight. Many moments later. I should have stuck with the... I should have followed the railway lines, actually. That would have been far more sensible. And then just popped out at whatever um, station I found first. Ah, here we go. Thank goodness at last. Right. Uh, turn the lights back on. Even though I've only got... Well, actually, one of, having one light on is probably more suspicious than having none. That was a suspiciously green car. Um, let's get out of here. <laughs> yeah, Pete wants me to turn the circle back on again. Um, yeah, I, I will, I will. But I just want to make sure I've got away from that. That was Mark behind. That's someone behind me. Damn it. Ah! So I, I, I did get away, kind of, but now I've, after having come back out of where I got away, I've immediately been picked up again by Tristan. That's really annoying. <sighs> it was, yeah, I I should have, I don't know, I, sh I should have been more careful. I should have got out and done something, got out of the tunnels a bit quicker because that was some fairly rubbish driving. Um... But, and I definitely shouldn't have got picked up again immediately by the hunters when I came out of there. That was... I mean, okay, may, mostly it was because I was driving a beaten up knackered car because I hadn't had an opportunity to change it. But still, it was rather frustrating. Very, very frustrating. Right, so if I could come down here. Normally what I'd do along here is shoot off down the... Um, and one of these is a way through. Is it this one? I think it's this one. This goes into a car park? Yes, it does. Right. Is there anyone behind... No. Oh, he's still behind me. Ah! Oh, that was a weird way of coming out there, but it kind of worked. Um, he's taken a wider line, which is probably going to work better and, keep, and allow him to keep more speed. But I had to slow down a lot because I wanted to see if he'd managed to follow me through there, rather than just blasting out the other side of it um, and potentially into another hunter. But no, that didn't work, unfortunately. So, um, I guess more. What's in here? Is this... Please don't be a dead end. Please don't be a, a that either. Oh no, I'm... I've Austin powers my car. Oh, he's... Gosh, I'm, I'm, rage. I think you're slightly faster than me, Tristan. That's not fair. <laughs> this does feel like a, or look like a supercar at least. Yeah, mine's electric as well, I think, by the sounds of it. Yeah, mine's electric. What, I, what do I have? Oh. Oh. oh, I've got the Paw Patrol car. <laughs> My car hasn't recolored properly.
Yep, I think so. Yes. Yep. Got him in a grey um, Prius heading towards Roosters, uh, heading towards... Oh. Vinewood checkpoint. That's the one, thank you. It's a guy in a grey long sleeve top. Sorry, Pete. Some people. <laughs> nice pet. Thank you. Heading south. Still heading south. Ah, uh, pedestrian, not pedestrian. AI driver. Uh, AI driver. <laughs> Still heading south. I've lost yes, uh, he's turning across the green air the grass area. Onto the highway. Uh, heading west. Okay. Circles off. Mm -hmm. Just yep. heading west at the moment. Good See old straight line trick. <laughs> I, I like the way in his last video, he go where we were mocking him for the straight line trick. He goes, "It's fine. Look, it works." Yeah. And then had to do as many <laughs> turns as he could to demonstrate the straight line worked. It's just like... Uh, <laughs> it's coming off here, Mike. Yeah, uh, so multicolored car park. Take a left at the top. Yep. Sorry, I got distracted. Uh, Mocking Lawrence, it's, it's yes. just a fireball. Heading towards pier, passing the pedestrian area. About uh, heading north towards pier now. Passing pier now, north. Pier entrance, that is. Clipped him. Nice pit. Nice. Heading Benefit north it. again. Trying to. Can't get tyres on this car. Okay, so you've got to work out how to stop him properly then. That'll help. Ooh. Oh, it will. Oh. Going off the edge. He's, he's taking a interesting attempt at a jump. He's going to be pinned up. Again. No, he's on the road. Going the wrong way back towards the tunnel. For, I know he's gone Moving on to the right side of road. Nice mark. Yep. Where are you going? <laughs> he's stayed right. I've managed to pit him by ramming an AI first. <laughs> nice. And then rebounding into him. He's bearing right, heading down beach. Uh, I managed to play well straight line drive. He's, That's embarrassing. He's I can he's see the sarcastic comments on the screen around, right now. Left and doubled back. South of up here, heading east. Passing the pedestrian area, going through the Spooky Canals. Uh, going over the bumps now. I'd be careful here because he could stop and turn quite quickly while I'm in the air. Uh, he's gone all the way through and turned left at the end. We're heading northeast, or more east. Away from beach checkpoint. Going straight across the intersection there. Why do I have a Prius? <laughs> he's in one as well. Uh, turning left. Where are we now? Oh, approaching to... Ah! Sorry. Ah, it's sorry. the AI. Uh-huh, uh, uh-huh. Chinese Monument, uh, heading west towards multicolored car park. He's turned his lights off. Passing the highway, passing multicolored car park. Turning left by movie studios. Ah! Tried to pit him and hit a wall. Approaching pier. Turning right at pier entrance, heading north. And he was kind enough to wait for me. Look out. Where's he going? Uh, back, back towards east. movie studios. Yeah, towards movie studios. Oh, you're fast. <laughs> yeah. This car may be a bit overpowered. Uh, clockwise around movie studios and then north at the north yeah. uh, going and west again anti clockwise around. Ah, sorry, Mike. Oh, north right. from the west side of movie studios, and then turn yeah. right just before the petrol station, and then left, and then straight across through an alley. 
Sorry. Uh, trying, yeah. trying to keep out Straight out. Um, and left at uh, towards um, Golf Course checkpoint. And, and left again. behind, yeah, behind the tennis courts. And oh, he's bend it into some AIs, you know what? Hell, time has come. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, no! <laughs> <laughs> That's dumb, me. I'm sorry. I blame Pete. <laughs> um, yeah, I would too. Uh, heading <laughs> clockwise. Oh, I had no turn to in that car. <laughs> I was I was like, I can't avoid you! <laughs> the most embarrassing thing is I was killed by a Paw Patrol car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, low car parks. Heading east. Why are there no cars anywhere? I lost you. Uh, golf course. North side of low car parks. On my way over. I'm uh, heading east again now. Away. Low car box heading east. North side. Seriously? Uh, turn mm -hmm. south by the eastmost uh, low car park. Okay. Uh, is this... Oh, police station. Okay. The, uh, approaching Alice Customs south side. Ah. Uh, Going through shopping centre now. <laughs> so close! Yep, see you in the distance. Turn right, I think. Thank you. I don't see him. Uh, someone's fast across the bridge of Cadius. Dog leg. But that's that one me. of you. Okay. No, I don't see him. It is lost. I, I, I'm fairly sure so I'm turning right there. Hey, buddy. You're if I saw a different car. It's fine, there'll only be uh, mocking text if, if you're Oh ready. yeah. I can read the mocking text on the screen now. Again. There'll be mocking text if you're right as well, it just won't be directed at you. <laughs> <laughs> True. Shot past the first the first junction where I found a, there was a, an SUV there. Second junction doesn't have one. Yeah, I'm checking the SUV now. There is a male in a long sleeve green T-shirt, but it looks like he's picking his females. Yeah, that's him. That's him. That's him. That's him. Where's he going? Uh, back uh, towards goal, the goal, checkpoint. Back on. A road parallel to you. These are pretty evenly matched cars. Yeah, I'm sure through. The same or not. On your left. On your yeah, left. except the <laughs> mic car. Still on which your is left. Ha 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 ha! Oh, I was I was starting to feel smug. <laughs> oh, yeah, don't, don't wait, where have you gone? Uh, uh, the horse horse guys, five ways. Yeah, five ways. Entering five ways now. Heading south. Uh, Massively overshot that junction. Still heading south. They're turning left to Dark Gallery. Oh Under the bridge, passing red what, car park now. What we need to do in, the, in either this chase or the next one, or in the next chase, is wait until he turns a corner and then all just shoot off in completely the wrong direction. And then just in chat post, he's not going in a straight line. What is this? Hashtag fake warrants? <laughs> <laughs> Speed, which I have uh, just absolutely driven in a straight line. Where are you guys? <laughs> turn north from higher lower. Uh, turning east at Penrith Building. Yeah, I'm well out of this chase now. You guys need to be better at directions. North at Pillbox <laughs> Hill. So I keep getting distracted by people talking. East onto the highway from Pillbox Hill. Uh, taking the right of the, the junction. 
taking the jump onto the slip road I've gone onto the highway he's on the slip road so he's probably going to double back I uh, don't know where that goes stand by Hello, Mark. oh he may have taken don't think he went into the storm drain it's possible One eternity later. Two days later. Uh, I found him. Oh, where? Uh, yeah. He's going up Pillbox Hill uh, from yeah. the highway. Turned right at Pillbox Hill. He doesn't know where the checkpoint is. He, he turned right again past Penrith, heading south now, higher of higher lower. Okay. All the way past the north side road car park. Uh, At a higher south, lower down, junction. Lower. Heading south. Got him. Down. Turned ah, right. Ah, couldn't turn. <laughs> <laughs> turned this west. turning circuit is ridiculous. Uh, approaching red car park. Yep, seen you guys. Turn You're one. Bit of front Passing of me. red car park, under the bridge. Turning left. Turning right, this weasel news. Yeah. Uh, turning right mm -hmm. again. Right again, is that? Yeah. Heading north towards five ways. Yep, that's the one, Mike. Ah, that would be busy. traffic lights. Turning right past that. Art Gallery. Turning left towards the highway or the tunnel. I don't see him going onto the highway, so I suspect going to the tunnel. Yes, he's in the tunnel. He's taken the second entrance, which is actually an entrance. I don't know where this goes. In, in the car park near there. Turning west towards, uh, across the front of Art Gallery. And uh, just heading west from there. North, as if due from, uh, towards Life Invader. Uh, turning right one road before life invader, but then immediately left into an alley. And he appears to have got stuck with some help. Got him. Nice. Ow. Ow. <laughs> My turning that Patriot was basically just bouncing off walls. That it worked better than the wheels. <laughs> <laughs> Mark might be the winner of the Battle Royale here. Yep, Mark wins the Battle Royale. <laughs> <laughs>